have the slightest... Whoa, what's that? Dana, are you... Oh. I'm just coming from a shoot Ooh. of this movie about the KGB. The KGB? Since when are you shooting a movie about the KGB? Oh, for, for several months, I... I mean, ever since... Dana, I... I need to tell you something. Cool, so, um, where are you headed? Dana, y you know, the KGB were like the last organization that no one actually held accountable for the amount of collateral damage they did to the... They don't... This doesn't happen anymore. I, I don't think. Dana, something may happen to you in these next few days. Something that will... Sure, Dana. So, where are you going? Dana, are you... I'm going to lunch. You want to join me? Diana. Diana! Do you ever get the feeling like <laughs> when you go somewhere and you get the feeling like something terrible has happened but you didn't know what? Um, actually... Like that gateway Something happened here. Uh, Dana, listen, you you won't believe me, but listen. No! Do not open that door. It's a murderer. He's gonna kill you. I am serious. He is out for blood. Do not open that please, door. Please, just let me in. Just tell me what you want from me. Why are you chasing me? Nothing. I'm not chasing you. Just, just please, just let me in. 
It's me, Mike. Mike? Mike. Mike? Robinson? The guy I met the, at the... Do not open! He will kill you! Who me. are you? Are you in this room? Thank God. Dana. Love. Thank you so much. I'd be lost without you. They were. You mean those people with knives? Who are they? God. Dana, you. You won't believe it. They. They were chasing me everywhere. Dana, my love. It's all for you, Dana. All for you. What, what are you doing? Dana, my darling. Get, oh, get away! No! number for emergency. Mike? Mike? Oh my god, Mike? He is dead. What? He is dead! Oh my god. It's happening again. Hi there, little girl. What's your name? I'm Dana. And this is... Who is this? It's me, the horse. The dead horse. Oh, really? I didn't know you'd talk. Well, now you do. So, wait, you have something to say? In the infancy of capitalist production, things often happen as in the infancy of medieval towns, where the question which of the escaped serfs should be master and which servant was in great part decided by the earlier or later date of their okay. flight. Fine, fine. The snail's pace of this method corresponded in no wise with the commercial requirements of the new world market that the great discoveries of the end of the 15th century had created. But the Middle Ages had had endowed two distinct forms of capital which mature in not different economic social formations and which, before the era of the capitalist mode of production, are considered as capital farm names, usurious capital and merchant capital. So this is how you repay me. Yes. This is this is how you repay me. Yes. 
I loved you, Dana. I... I... I cured you. What do you mean? You don't remember even that. You were mortally ill. And I... I cured you. Useless to resist. I'm soon departed. Do not bury me. I've done too many ravenous cataclysms. My ambition has ensnared too many. But it is only a beasting. You cannot! I spared you, bastard. But a bee did not. It's just a bee. It's just a simple bee. How could it be? Control yourself, lady. You heathen! Did you have to eradicate my last muse? Cut! All right. Picture up. Oh We're my done God, shooting. You guys are so awesome. I love all you guys. My thing is on me. my movie yeah so what did you think wow I mean Dana I I really think Dana is like the best actress that ever lived like in that scene when she says oh god annihilate the time and the cosmos it's like it's 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 such passion it's such God Wow. You, th you thought William was convincing in that? Like, the whole thing with the bee and stuff? You know, the Middle Ages was like the last time people could think of themselves as heroes. And then he gets stung by a bee, and he's done for. But was William maybe, like, too modern for... Yeah. And, you know, Dana was phenomenal. Like, really. Thanks. I'll, I'll tell her. But what about... You are so lucky to have her. Well, Aside from that, did the movie move you at all? Did the story hit you in any real way? Yeah. I couldn't believe what I saw. Like, when she's dying on the field and agonizing. And Dana is so beautiful, too. She is so... Dana? 
Dana? Dana. Oh, Jesus. Diana, call emergency, please. Hurry! What, what comes after that again? Jesus Christ, Diana, it's one. The nine, one, one. So sorry. You lie! I'm sorry. What? 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 It's too late! What? It's incurable! We cannot help you. There is no, no cure, no cure! She's gonna die, 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 die! When? When? Soon. Tomorrow at the latest. I'm sorry, we cannot help her. She's beyond help. Let me go. Let me go! No! I won't! I will save her! There is no cure, but I will save her! I have nothing else to do but with my life anyway. I, I love Dana too much to let this happen to her. I will save her. And I did. I did, Dana. For a year, I labored in the lab, called together all the best doctors and scientists that I could find around the world. I cryogenically froze your body so that you wouldn't die. And then I labored labor and I cured you oh my god Mike if only I had known Mike but tell me why are all those people chasing us hmm? Mike he is dead they were mostly chasing him, you know. It's him they really wanted. But they figured you would be easier to get to. That they could take you hostage and get him that way. But who are they? Who? Just regular people, like you and me. The mob, the police, the janitors, your next door neighbor. Why, everyone. He had a price on his head. Wanted. 
alive or dead. But why? Why? Why, what do you think? You think it was easy to find a cure for you? You think he did it for free? Hell, he's been terrorizing the whole city for months to get the money for his research. You won't believe all the collateral damage he did to the... Now, it was finally payback time. What did he do? <laughs> what do you think? Can I speak with the mayor? No! Listen to me. Outside of this building, the whole city is frozen. Every single person that isn't in here is frozen. Can't you see? You have to give me the 600 million or I will be forced, understand? Forced to leave them like that. Mercy, please. So what's it going to be? Please, it's yours. Money is yours. Just take it and get out of here, please. Oh God, they will find out, they will find out that I killed him, and they will execute me. Just the bust of Lenin. Just a simple bust of Lenin. How could it be? God! They shouldn't find out! Please! No! Please don't let them find out! We already have. What? We have come to annihilate you.
Thank you.